Capcom presents, in the year 20XX AD, the first annual robot tournament was held. <laughs> With eight of the world's most powerful robots. But... What what? <laughs> Mr. X, the sponsor of the tournament, took control of the robots and begun to take over the world. Mr. X, why? It's time to tell you the truth. I have been manipulating that fool, Dr. Wily, from the beginning. But now I no longer need Dr. Wily's help. Come and face my power, Mega Man. We'll stop you. Follow me, Rush. Welcome, everybody, to Let's Play Mega Man 6. This is the last game on the Super Nin er, on the Nintendo. The last Mega Man game on the Nintendo. A uh, couple things to note out. First and foremost, I am sick of a dog. I am sick as a dog playing this right now. I guess Final Fantasy VI made me sick. Oh, we're getting a. Oh, I didn't want to do that. We're getting a. There we go. Yeah, I guess um. I don't know what. I just I'm really sick, and uh, today's my only chance really of getting any recording done. So I figured I better well record it, even though I'm sick. So I'm doing this for you guys. You're welcome. Also, this Let's Play is long overdue, as far as recording. I would have been recording this last week, but I wasn't satisfied with my final area playthrough of Mega Man, uh, Final Fantasy VI, so I had to re-record that. Uh, what you see, what you watch, was not the first take. Uh, I wasn't happy with the first take. That's not really the time and place to talk about that. Right now, let's concentrate on Mega Man VI. We got eight Robot Masters, as usual. Uh, if you're looking for uh, the best one to start with, uh, as far as the Mega Buster, well, like the previous game, the Mega Buster charged up shot is so powerful that it's about the equivalent of using a uh, Robot Master's weakness on them. So there's no real need to, uh, like, each one is about as, takes about as much damage with the Mega Buster as the rest of them, so. I'm gonna start with Flame End, though. Height attack, yeah, that gives all his stats. It's pretty cool. Master of the Flame. Oil Field. I love this music so much. Um, the reason I start with Flame Man is because, uh, well, and it's funny because he's kind of, I would say he's the hardest to use a Mega Buster on. But this game has some collectibles, and I'd like to get all the collectibles without backtracking. And to do that, Flame Man is the best one to start with. We got globs of oil. I uh, can't get that. Yeah, there's no rush coil. It's gone. We'll get rush, but not in that form. These guys launch fire, so watch out for them. Uh, if you've played any other Mega Man games, you know what it's like. Alright, these fields of oil, when uh, those dudes drop down little blitz of fire, they hit the oil fields, the oil ignites, and well, we got a full fire going on. And if you touch it, it's insta-kill, and I think I done screwed up because I can't get that health pack now. I'm gonna try it. Alright, yeah. Don't touch the fire. Yeah, these guys. Couldn't be easier. Yeah, I was hoping I would get something out of that. And yeah, I love this music, although most of this game's music isn't all that great. I like this track. These guys, when they open up, you just shoot them. Oh, my bad. You uh, charge up a Mega Buster and shoot them, and they tip over like that. And of course, they land in the oil, and you can actually uh, ride them. Keep jumping to make them go. And, uh... Oh gosh, oh gosh! Yeah, don't panic when the... Oil ignites, these guys will still ride the oil. But don't touch it. Alright. Oh boy. Yeah, I've been wanting to record Mega Man 6 for a long time now, and I just haven't had the time. Well, today's the day. Um, this is probably the easiest of the Mega Man games. And also the least interesting to me. Truth be told, there is a gimmick, a gameplay gimmick, that I find really awesome. 
and it involves Rush. But, whoa! Aside from that, this game isn't interesting at all. Oh gosh, yeah, those guys will ignite the oil too, so... In fact, I better save, because this part could give me trouble. Uh, ah, I was hoping that would... There's an E-Tank, which I will be getting. I think. Oh boy, that was bad. Ah, losing, losing HP. Did you die? Oh, I was hoping he wouldn't do that. It's been so long since I played a platformer. It took me so long to do Mega or to do Final Fantasy VI. I did that like for like two or three months. Okay, I can't face um, Flyman like this. So I'm gonna have to let myself die, and I'll attempt it, but I'll most likely have to let myself die and just do it over again. Because I lost too much health. He, I think, does that, which is really annoying. See, apart from that, he's not that hard. See, dodging this isn't hard. Sorry if I'm not talking. Oh, he got me. I knew he would get me. All's the better. Now I have full health. All right, let's take him on. Oh, ugh. Now, I feel so horrible right now. You have no idea. All sorts of drainage. My stomach's can er, nauseous. I might be throwing up in this let's play. <laughs> we'll try not. <coughs> I just got all this junk. That's the worst part. Oh boy. This ain't working. If I die again, I'll reload the state. Yeah. Take that. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can do that. Oh, missed him. Oh, sweet! I killed him. I wasn't even paying attention to his health bar. I had one shot left on me, and I held on to that shot for all that it was worth. Ugh. <coughs> Ugh, I feel so horrible. Alright! Oh! He shot me in the face. You get F-Blast and Rush Power Adapter. Sweet. Well, that was the first of our collectibles. I'll show you what it does in the next Robot Master. All right, let's go to the stage select. Let's save. Our next one is Blizzard Man. Ah, Frozen Island, Master of the Snow. All right, now. Well, the Rush Power Adapter, the way it works, Rush comes down and he morphs into an, uh, an adapter and buffs Mega Man out. Now you can skip that animation all the time. So you, uh, he does these uh, short little buster punches which are really uh, powerful and you can charge it up into a really short range attack. Can't slide though. So yeah. And it doesn't use it. Oh yeah, and the bombs! I think this is the first game with those bombs. Uh, oh, that was awesome. Hey, let's get out of this already, because, uh, yeah, just, just cuz. Although, if I backtrack, I just, I kind of screwed up. Well, that's not a big deal, but I kind of screwed up. Oh, wow, I can't hit him. That's fun. I want to get that life. There we go. To get that life, what you do is you, uh, you take the flame blast. That was a fail. There we go. And there we go. Now, the question is how do I get it out of here? 
Oh, wasn't paying attention to the uh, ice. Alright. Ah, well, you know what? I'm not even gonna worry about that life. It's just gonna have to fend for itself. And yeah, the bombs, you step on those and they explode after three seconds. So there you go. You'll see those in, uh, I think, pretty much the rest of the series. Oh, uh, no, okay, I thought there was something over there. Alright. Ow! Oh yeah, the shield mask. Awesome. Uh, I can get this E-Tank, though. Alright. Okay, hang on a second. Uh, screw it. I should've, should've slid. I, I, just, I jumped. What was I thinking? You know what? I'll just go ahead and show you. The main purpose of the power adapter. Charge it up when you come to a block like this that is cracked. Hit it. Bam! You'll break it. Um, there's another rush adapter. Ow, would you stop hitting me? I hate you. I haven't played this game in so long, so I'm really rusty. Oh yeah, this guy. I love this guy. Ah! Ah! Alright, sweet. Uh, I'm a little scared right now. Oh, water. Uh, spikes, actually. Oh, I know what's coming up. The ship goes up and down. Up and down. Don't go too high because it, uh, you got spikes. And you got the, I don't know, what do you call them? Cannon Joes? So there you go. Okay, he doesn't have anything. Oh! Watch this, I'm gonna cheat the system. Kind of. Haha! -ha. Jump down here. Just watch out for the spikes, is all I can say. And I know it, I know it's in here, I think. Oh, that was risky. Got an E-Tank. Let's wait this one out. Alright. Stand right here. And I think I ought to uh, change back into normal. And... Sweet platforming. Love it. Oh, gosh. Jump! Gosh, he wouldn't jump. Uh, and then just do that. Alright, we're doing good, we're doing good. Oh, uh, yeah, I just gotta take this guy up. I hate you. You know what, just, just go. That, I screwed up there. One, two, three. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, I'm all the way back here. That sucks. Oh, well. Anyway, if I hadn't gotten Flame Man first, I wouldn't be able to get these E-Tanks. So that's kind of what I mean when I say there's... And there's more collectibles, too. So let's just wait this one out. Ah, I'm a daredevil. Right. Uh, let's uh, save here and try to get past this guy without getting hurt. Ah. All right. All right. There we go! Now Blizzard Man will probably kill me. I 
think I should be able to take him out, though. And there he is! What you got, bud? Okay, when he does that move, you can't hit him. Okay, he's really wanting to do that move. Okay, uh, yeah, I failed that horribly. That's fine. Let me do it with full health. How many lives do I have? Zero. So after this guy, I'll probably kill myself and try to redo it. Or I'll kill myself and get a game over and get all my lives back. I'm okay with doing that. Uh, his blizzard attack is so easy to dodge. The only reason I screwed up is because he had me cornered. Oh, gosh. Would you stop doing that? Alright, that was easy. Okay, so we got the first two robot masters down, and I'm sorry if I haven't really been talking that much. I've been concentrating, and I feel so crappy right now, so just kind of got to deal with it. Ah! You get the B attack, blizzard attack, and... That's it. That's what it does. Sweet. Right, let's go to the stage select. Uh, between now and the next video, I'm going to re-enter one of these old stages and just let myself die and get all my lives back. And I'll meet you back in the next video with more lives. Until then, I'm 480. See you then.